So up next in the book is an example. And I very strongly recommend you look at this. Express the following sets of numbers using interval notation. And we have a set builder and we want to write in interval notation. So what does that mean? Now don't look down here at the solution. Here is where you need to stop reading math and start doing math. So take some scratch paper, cover up all the solutions, and just focus on number one and see if you can figure out, all right, x is greater than or equal to negative two, or less than or equal to negative two, or greater than or equal to two. So write out a number line and figure out exactly uh, where that starts and ends and what's included.